change. So why change the clocks at all? It seems like such a hassle each year. Yeah, it really does. Meteorologist Steve Fundero joins us now with a little bit more. I was really hoping like for some reason that the clock in my car would automatically be changed when I got in this morning. <laughs> I got a new car. I thought maybe, you know, just yeah. my phone changes automatically. No. Yeah. It's the one way to get everyone cranky. Yeah, because you can't, can't figure out how right? to change the clock. <laughs> can't figure out how to change the clock. We all lose the hour of sleep. We have to wake up to be feeling like the teens Sunday morning and, and yeah. on top of losing right? the hour yeah, of sleep, cold. right? So there are many reasons why we do deal with daylight saving time and why it's used. Primarily, though, it's just simply to match the sunrise with a reasonable time that we wake up to start our day. Now, as we head into the height of summer, we'll be approaching that sunrise before 6 a.m. and the sunset well after 7 p.m. But why not have this all year long? It does feel like something that everyone would want to have all year long. Long, We want that extra hour of light in the evening. Well, actually, back in the 70s, 1974, the United States actually did that. We actually tried to do away with standard time for a whole year but that only lasted a year. While the extra hour of sunlight in the evening seems nice, especially in the winter, that also means darker and longer mornings. The sunrise in the deep winter, November to December and February, it would shift from 7 a.m. to 8 a.m., even later than that. So there would be mornings where you would wake up and get the kiddos ready for school, and they'd be waiting at the bus stop. And it'd be pitch black, it'd be dark, it'd be cold outside. So I think it's easier to wake up when the sun is up to start our day. And I think this week the weather will cooperate with that sunrise, making it feel a little bit more like yeah. spring. Yeah, and, but we're all still kind of getting used to things. Uh, by, <laughs> by the way, my car, for the first time in six months, magically set itself to the correct time on Sunday. <gasps> really? For the first time in six months. You anyway, uh, take it. You think it's the diesel fuel? <laughs> no, it could be. Because you're paying extra for that, yeah, so that's well, probably. No kidding. Here's a look at what's going on.